Hello everyone, my name is Logan Mansion of Logan Mansion Games. Please welcome you all back to this messages. Okay, I'm gonna click start. Yeah, her walking in the blizzard right here. A heavy blizzard stretched on for miles. In the distance I saw a figure. May? It's not safe to be here. May, is that you? Come back. She just smiled, looking content at missed the dangerous tale, as if she was going somewhere better, as if she hadn't heard my voice lost in the blizzard. Well, yeah, she might be, like, going to heaven or something, because she, she died last time. Don't go. Please don't. Please don't. Please, don't go. Please don't go alone. She disappeared into the snow. I'd missed my chance. Wake up in a cold sweat, fearful but not sure why. What was that about? Never mind that. I should start working. To let people know I'm gay and not just, and don't just like flannels. That is actually quite common, <laughs> not gonna lie. Oh, paper, what's this? My precious Madoka Magica poster, which really is just a printout. God, they're, they're cute. And some notes from my friend and roommate, May. You alright, love May. Hope midterm went well. Got you boba, it's in the fridge. You alright? Both of us, who is both distant and a total sweetheart. Yeah, I remember once having like a little um, picture of Mario, Paper Mario printed out on my wall. And it, it, was even, it was even in black and white too, so yeah, I remember that years ago. Nice. 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 The, outs the door to the outside world. Bathroom. <laughs> gotta do what I gotta do, then go back. My roommate's door. She can't it open now, it's usually closed. I remember that dream I had. Ugh, I need to work. But I'm so bored, I can't focus. What's this? Should I accept it? I'll do... I do some work and start wondering when I'll ever... When I'll ever have to use this in the real world. Where is Bill Nye when I need him to answer my important questions? I hear weird voices. Seems like they're coming from my roommate's room. Although Chinese was not, was, not, although my Chinese was bad, I could still detect an angry Chinese mother when I heard one. <laughs> Too lazy, why don't you? Her mother's fast lecturing Chinese sometimes paused her May's soft murmur from of affirmation when continued. I felt like I was listening to something I should have so distant myself from the door. So cute. Hmm, planes. And some 
y mod y equals mx plus b. After some time, I start to lose focus. Noise from my roommate's room had quiet down. I spent 30 minutes trying to understand, but ultimately ended up confused. Why am I a fool, a hooligan, an oaf with a PhD in buffoonery? Thank you for dog. I wonder if she'll respond. Jesus, time has flown by. It's like 5 p.m. right now. My, I wonder if I should check up on her. You good? I hesitated to knock. For some reason, I feared that I might find. Hello? Hey! Yes? Hmm. Shit. What should I say? Looking for sock? Hang out? You okay? I just want to make sure you're okay. I heard noises from your room earlier. Aw, thank you. I'm fine. Er, well, kind of sad, but don't worry about me. Do you want to hang out with me in case you don't want to be alone? I like that, but I have to do work. I have work to do. Take a break. You always have to have work to do. You should take a break. Besides, we haven't hung out for a long time. I missed you. Aw, I could use a break, to be honest. And I missed you too. Okay, hold on a sec. She went back into her room to get something. When she came back, we laid on my bed looking out at the setting sun. Uh, what should I talk about first? How about just life? What are you up to these days? I feel like we haven't caught up in a long time. Um, a lot, and also not much. A lot? Uh, sorry, I haven't stayed updated. Haha, <laughs> stay updated? Like I'm your favorite TV show? Don't worry about it. I feel... Like, I don't make enough time for you. Aw, that's okay. You're not obligated to. Oh yeah, it's your birthday, right? Haha, <laughs> I forgot you remembered. Is she gonna sing happy birthday to her? Of course I did. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. She's saying me happy birthday. Aw, thank you for remembering. As the years flew by, my birthday became like any other day. No one else had remembered it either, but she had. Um, I don't know, um, airdrops, I guess? Or how about dream? I had a weird dream. Oh, what? It was about you, actually. It was kind of haunting. Oh, God. I need to hear this. You were in a snowstorm, and I called for you, but you didn't hear me, and I lost you. Huh? What does that mean? I have no idea, but it stuck with me. Aw, uh, I hope you're okay. I hope you're okay, too, May. Just a dream. Here, if you're still scared by bedtime, I'll tell you, you, I'll tell you a bedtime story, okay? Aw, yeah, bedtime stories. 
I'll, I'm gonna talk about airdrops. So there's this girl I've been airdropping back and forth with. Oh, about what? Memes, haha. <laughs> you. I hope I'm not stopping you. If you're busy, we could talk some other time. You're fine. Nah, you're chilling. Oh, okay, if... Okay, if you're sure. Do you think she's just sending memes or she's interested in me? The question of our generation. You think she's gay? I don't know. You should ask. Yeah. Yeah. I already like someone, or... Let's see what this gives. I already like someone, though. Oh, spill the tea. Who is it? Um, you, probably. I don't... Um, you probably don't know her. She's a really... She's a really great friend. Aw, boo. How do I confess to her in a... In a non-embarrassing way? What? Like, a way where you can still be friends afterwards if she rejects you. Um... Aha. Uh -huh. Why don't you ask her... Ask her to the movies. Then start putting your arm around her. See whether she snuggles into you. If there's a good... If there's good sign after the movie, you could ask her out for a real date. Watch a movie with me. Would you like to go watch a movie with me? Yeah, I'd like that. No, I... Never mind. Huh? Nothing. Let me know how it goes. I can't wait. I swear to God. I don't know what to ask. This music sounds very similar to the kind blame it on George used to have in his videos, and that he still kind of uses to this day. One of his non-creepy sounding types of music, though. Because I know so whenever I used to watch, like, some certain videos of his at nighttime, I used to be really creeped out just because of the music he had in his videos. And I think he actually acknowledged this one time when he was on Rebel Taxi's channel. He's like, what, I'm just trying to make a video. I'm not trying to make it with scary music. <laughs> I don't know. He's a pretty good YouTuber, I'll admit. Anyway, um, I don't know. Should I ask how she is or ask about May's romance life? I think I might ask how, she's, how she is. How have you been? Fine, just tired. Big mood, how so? I don't know. Like a bone depth tiredness. Day after day. Hey, that's the name of uh, Emika Games' cancelled game that never happened. Which sucks. What do you mean? Depressed? What do you mean? What do you mean? Like... Every day I wake up, force myself to do something I don't like, and go back to sleep. I, I totally get Chime. Sometimes I look outside my window and I see a whole world out there. And feel the struggle of being stuck inside all day. Huh. I, I understand. Uh, I think I can understand that. You can? I mean, I feel like that when I absolutely must do something I don't like, like math. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're definitely not alone. I feel like a lot of people do things because they are supposed to, not because it makes them happy. 
I think it's more than doing things that make you happy, though. Need I need a purpose. I want to feel like my life has this di direction. It's cliche, but why don't... Why not do what you love? It's not that easy. If I knew what I loved doing, I'd be doing it by now. But I don't know what I want to do. I, I totally get you, May. I'll help you. I'll help you. We'll figure this out. I'll try out every hobby and profession with you if that's what it takes. Thank you. Why are you so good with me? Because I'm worried about you and I care about you. I want you to feel better. Um, parents. Oh yeah, what were those noises about? Huh? Either earlier in your room. Ah, uh, my mom called. Sorry. Did I bother you? No, she sounded really angry though. Y uh, yeah. She and I... Is everything okay with you two? I don't know. Every time my mom calls, I feel sick, angry, Wanna talk? Do you wanna talk about it? Talk about what? Your mom. Why she makes you feel that way. Ha, uh, you sound like a therapist. How are you feeling? Why are you feeling that way? I just want to help you. Yeah, I know. I was always the golden child. When I was young, I was good at everything, so my parents never pushed me to work hard at anything. I grew up, I started lagging behind because I didn't put in effort. The only thing I would put effort into was writing. They yelled at me when they caught me writing. Writers weren't engineers or doctors. Writing would never make money. Now my life is slowly falling apart and instead of listening to me or help and helping me, my parents are yelling at me for wasting time playing games. Wow, thank you for telling me this. That's fuck. Yeah, it is fuck. I totally get you made. Thanks for listening. I don't know why whenever, like, the text option is, like, um, like, this bluish color, it doesn't shade as a darker color, like, the, um, reddish one or the yellowish green one. Writing? What did you write about before your parents made you stop? Oh my god, it's embarrassing. You tell me. Okay. You won't laugh. I promise. Harry Potter fan fiction. Uh. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you said you wouldn't laugh. Sorry, I'm just surprised. Don't be ashamed. That's awesome. I love Harry Potter. I don't. Ugh. If, if you say so. I do say so. <laughs> Whenever I think of Harry Potter fanfiction, I just think of Harry Potter becomes a communist. <laughs> It's so bad, it's good.
<laughs> anyway, um, I, I write stories too. The type of stories I like are the type of stories I write are more still original type stuff, not really fan fiction. I'm not gonna say what it is now, but yeah, I'm working on some a lot of projects right now. Anywho, um, moving on. Um, write more. Why not do more of that then? Everyone likes writing, though. Anything creative, art, music, writing, it doesn't count. That's not true. There's plenty of successful writers out there. But I'm not, well, not, but I'm not them. I'd never be able to make a living out of it. And my parents would get so angry. Eh, fuck your parents. Who cares? Poor but happy. Would you rather live the way you're currently living or live poor but happy? Besides, who says you're not good enough to make it profitable? I don't know. What are you thinking? Your parents will go. What are you thinking? What are you thinking of? Uh... I could be a good writer if I worked hard at it. But it's not much easier to give up and just not work. You could give up. I see struggle as a hill I need to climb to get the reward at the other end. You could give up or you could get the reward at the other side. Motivational speaker much? Haha, <laughs> nah. I've just had a lot of hills that I've just wanted to give up on. Have you ever given up? Nope. Well, sometimes. If it's something I couldn't care less about, like math, haha. <laughs> but if I care about it, then I pull through and I never regret it. I'm going to work harder at getting my life back together. Though... Though... Though thought... Yeah, it's hard to work on something you don't like. Give me a math problem and I'll snore. But give me a computer science problem and I'll look at it for hours. That's funny, because I'm also a computer... I'm, I'm a computer science major, so that's, that's great. I was surprised I was able to get a um, an A in math in college, by the way. Anyway, moving on. Thanks. I really mean it. I think my parents got into my head. I need your push. Anytime. Stare outside. This is relaxing, but I'm also getting tired. Ha ha. Really? I'm wide awake. Okay, Katy Perry. I think I'm just tired in general. How so? Do you ever feel like every day is the same day? Yes. Kind of. It's a satisfying sort of monotony. A day where I stay inside, windows open, with tea and a book is the gold shit. Oh. Do you not feel the same? I don't know. I feel like I wake up, do things I don't enjoy, go to sleep, then do it all over again. I get ya. Depressed? Do you think you're depressed? Uh, um, maybe. I took antidepressants a long time ago, but I felt like they didn't work. Anyway. Um, yeah. That sucks. Maybe it's the type of antidepressant. 
maybe you need to try a different one. Uh, don't take my advice, actually. I don't know it. I know nothing. Ha ha. Me neither. Not just about this, but in general. I feel you. Has it gotten better, the tiredness? Not really, but now I kinda just want to die. Understandable, suicidal. Um, I'll ask that. Of course I already know who he is, but still. Are you suicidal? Uh... Oh god, sorry, that was too blunt. I feel free not to answer. No, 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 you're good. Yeah, I think about it sometimes. I feel like we all do, though. I imagine how it'll go down, how it'll look, the smell, the aftermath. No. Oh. Whether anyone would care that I was gone, not just about how I went. Are you serious? Do you think about it seriously? Um, I'd rather not say. Sometimes I think about it. Then I stop- I'm stopped by the thought of the pain I'll cause others. Professional help? Have you considered getting professional help? I don't know. Good doctors seem so rare. I've had a bad experience with the health, mental health sources at school, at least. I'll come with you. Bad experience? Bad experience? What do you mean? Uh, one time I, ans I answered I was suicidal on a school survey and I got brought to see a school counselor. She forced me to answer her questions. I was suicidal, how I was going to do it, that, what was going on. Even though I didn't want to, I was sobbing. I couldn't form sentences without hiccuping. I didn't want to, but they made me. It took a few hours, but it helped so long. That's awful. I see why you're afraid of seeking help. I'm not afraid, I'm just... Okay, I am afraid. Yeah, school counselor... School counselors aren't really the place you should go to when it comes to, like, you know, mental health and stuff, because... They don't fucking know shit. I I'm sorry, but they usually don't fucking know shit. Even, like, school nurses, if they're there, usually know more. I'll come with you. I'm afraid. You don't need to be afraid. I'll come with you to find a good doctor. We'll drive you every place in this town until we find a good one. You'd do that for me? Yeah. Thank you. Aw, she's smiling back at me. Let time pass. Well, I guess this is all I can do. We talk more about everything and nothing. From TV shows and memes to our worst fears and biggest desires. Before we knew it, everything dawned. I gotta go. I have work. Yeah, good luck. I'm always down to hang again. Yeah, thank you for listening to me. It really means a lot. Although I also had work, I didn't regret taking... talking with May one bit. Shortly after that day, May moved out. I haven't heard from her since. Before she left, she had written me a note. It was buried in the blizzard. The snow felt wonderful and unpredictable, never-ending. 
I weakly cried for help, and no one came. My voice lost in the snow. But you saw my message. You grabbed a shovel, helped me. I could finally open my door. I wonder whether she'll reply. I wonder whether she's still alive. Well, it kind of sucks that I got, like, the survivor ending again, but hey, at least it was a good ending. Surviving one night at a time, thank you for playing. But hey, you know, it was kind of cool I took, like, a different path and stuff. I'll try to get the actual, um the actual uh, final ending, the hope ending soon, but for now I think I'm just going to end the video right here, but if you liked it, make sure to click the like button and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos from me, let me know your thoughts in the comments section, but as always, thank you all for watching, and have a great day, bye everyone.